Okay, today I'm making sheaths for these two knives, and these are the materials I'll be using. The buttons and straps will be to help hold them in. Um, when these sheaths are finished, I'll show the finished product. To start, first things I have to do is this is for the smaller one. This strap needs to be stitched to the back here to make a belt loop. Then this smaller st strap will be stitched on like this. Then a button, one of these brass buttons, since the fittings are brass, will be, I'll put it on here. I'll adjust the length of the this strap after I get the knife in so I can get a good snug fit. And then this strap will fit just above these pieces so that it'll show the handle to the best advantage. This one is similar but it will have a wraparound strap. It will come like this. And, which I couldn't do with the smaller one because the, the bottom of the guard here is too small for that to work, but it'll work well on this one. To hold them tighter in the sheath, I put these little leather pieces inside the sheath they put pressure on the knife, plus they're almost as wide as the guard this way, so they'll push the back of the sheath away from the knife and help it fit better in the sheath, and it will help hold it tighter. This will help hold the sheath blade retention. That's what I did with this one. You can see the thick leather piece in here. But eventually, this does work loose, and so this one will also need a strap before long. So after a while, this will work loose, so I will put a strap here on this one as well. Um, these are the straps, the buttons, the pieces. My awl that I use to help make the holes larger, and of course, a needle. Imitation sinew for stitching it up. Once I get them when I stitch them, I will do a double stitch. I do this cross hatch stitch, and then I will come back, go all the way around, and then come back so they can get the cross hatch. This one is double stitched. It has a single stitch going this way, just a straight stitch, and then the wraparound stitch. But that takes a lot of time and uses a lot of extra sinew that's not really necessary. I did something similar to this with the All-American knife, however, that knife has such a heavy handle that even with this leather piece here, it won't stay, stay in the sheath very well. However, I did put a strap on that sheath to help that'll hold it and catch the guard so it won't fall out. Um, when I'm done with this, I will show the finished sheaths and the knives in them. Um, thank you for watching. Feel free to share and comment.